is the first I3, which is originally destined as the uh, race director's car or medical car, the cars out the back. And it has the a early generation Qualcomm Halo wireless charging system. So this is a 3.3 kilowatt system, uh, delivering that full power into the battery. So you can plug it into any standard wall socket in your garage. Um, but we also have 6.6 .6 kilowatt systems and 20 kilowatt systems. So on a car like this, 3.3 charges in approximately 7 hours for an overnight charge. When we upgrade this to a 6.6 .6 kilowatt system, uh, we get the charge down to 2 or 3 hours. Um, it takes range anxiety out of the vehicle, uh, allows the car always to be full, jump out in the middle of the night if you want to drive to the dairy or something, the car's ready to go. Um, the system has two main safety systems as part of it. One is a foreign object detection. If tin cans or other metallic objects roll underneath the car, they're detected and shuts down the system. And the other one's a living object protection. So if an animal, a child is under the car, they're detected and also the system shuts down. When that happens, the owner, the driver can be notified, uh, they can come out and clear the object and the charge restarts. Um, so this is the start of our, our relationship with uh, Formula E. We're going to upgrade these systems on these cars, both in power and performance. Uh, right now we're sitting about 90% efficiency, and we're going to take this up over to about 95% efficiency as we increase the power. Uh, this display can be integrated into the actual car's display, uh, and then the user would click start a line to start the alignment process. Now we're already over the pad, the base pad, perfectly aligned, so we can turn the car off. and then the charge process will start automatically. So basically if you just pull into the garage uh, from driving in, the alignment process could start automatically or you can manually start it. Uh, when you're aligned, you'll get an audio and a visual warning. Turn the car off, get out as you normally would and the charge is automatic. The charge will stop automatically when the, uh, the battery is fully charged. If we drive forward as if you were just coming into your garage, you'll get an audio warning and it's aligned. So you can go past it. Sorry, I went a bit fast. And then when you are aligned, there's actually an area of alignment. So you get quite a big tolerant zone of approximately 300 millimetres, both X direction, which is the driving direction, and the, the Y direction. So again, if we just drive on to the alignment. Aligned. Then turn the car off. The charge will start automatically. 